Hi guys, welcome back to the Crafter's Kitchen. Today is a piece of the coffee part of our channel and I got this amazing new Ninja Coffee Bar for Christmas and we're gonna make some iced coffee. So my husband was already nice enough to assemble it all and run it through the cleaning and priming and all that good stuff that this handy dandy starter's guide tells you to do. I've got my awesome Tupperware cup, got some ice in there. We're gonna put it in here. This thing swivels out and just looks so cool. Of course, I've got my Starbucks coffee. And the scoop that it comes with tells you what you should do as far as how many scoops, but some of it does come down to preference of taste of the flavor. So for this size of cup, this is three to five scoops. I think we'll just put some more in the middle until I get a feel for what it's going to be like. about a half a cup of milk in here um, of course it comes with all kinds of recipes and directions we're just gonna do what seems right and I'm gonna hit over ice and I've got it on an extra large cup instead of this traveler cup because I think that's all the coffee I'm gonna want and then I think Yep, it already started when I hit over ice. So uh, you select your cup size and then what kind of brew you want and then pour it in there. Okay, 
I think it's done. So it does have this feature right here, which is a drip stop, and you can pull it like this so it stops any further dripping. Now, just some notes. Oh, it was beeping, telling me that it was done right there. I was a little impatient. <coughs> So it says in here to always fill your vessel to the top with ice cubes before brewing over ice. Don't use any glassware. It gives you all these great tips so that you don't make a mess in your kitchen like I might have. Um, of course, it has some great recipes in the back. I'm going to go ahead and add two Splendos and some sugar-free caramel and maybe a little more milk. Uh, but this is what it's looking like. I don't really measure it. If you are a measuring kind of person, you guys watch my channel know that I'm not. I don't measure in the kitchen really much either. Um, there is recipes in the book that it comes with. That's the quick start guide. And um, for a, car a caramel iced coffee, it tells you how to do the scoops. Um, two cups of ice, quarter cup of caramel sauce, a quarter cup or a half and half. Um, I'm using 1% milk, but you can use whatever you uh, prefer, and um, I think it's going to be great. I'm going to add a little more milk and stir it up with a straw, and I've got my own home-brewed iced coffee with caramel sauce. Thanks so much for watching, you guys, and uh, if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next video.